Welcome to the world of Circanova, innovation for healthcare. Let us perceive the experience of Outmate Delicate Operation brought by Circanova Healthcare Technologies. The following is an instructional video of alligator-powered endoscopic stapler from Circanova. Alligator is a smart, precise, and reliable stapler that can operate it with one hand. Alligator is a composed of stapler, linear cutter reloads, and battery pack. The stapler cannot be disassembled except the battery pack over. Its main functional parts include close fire button, open reverse button, deflection button, rotary joint, insurance button, and emergency gears. Now let's see how to operate it. Scrapped nurse open the battery pack over. Circulating nurse inserts the battery pack along the direction of the arrow on the battery pack. Be careful not to touch the stapler. Scrapped nurse puts back the battery pack cover without touching the battery pack. When the battery pack cover is put back in place, the status indicator on the top of stapler is green. Ensure that the staple, retaining cap, and slat are intact. Make sure that the jars are open. Slat. The reload into the bottom of the reload cartridge from the middle unit. The reload alignment tab is locked in the slot. Then remove the protective cap after hearing a click sound. After confirming that the reload is positioned correctly, long press the close button to close the jars. After entering the body cavity, press the open button to open the jars. The deflection button can be triggered to adjust. The articulation angle as needed. The jars can articulate from zero degrees to forty-five degrees to the left or right. If necessary, use the index finger to adjust the rotary joint. The shaft will rotate freely in any direction. After confirming the position of the jars is correct, long press the close button to close the jars. After the jars are fully closed. The insuring button indicator flashes blue. When preparing to fire, press the insuring button left or right to release the insuring to start firing. After pressed, the blue insuring indicator will get into the always on state. Long press the fire button to activate the stapler, and the motor will make a sound when starting. Keep holding the fire button. Until the anastomosis is completed, after the anastomosis, press a reverse button to withdraw the knife and open the jaws before removing the stapler. Keep the jaws open within the range of visibility. If firing under articulation, long press the deflection button to get the jaws returned to the middle. Long press the close button to close the jaws and take the stapler out. Insert the forceps or pointed tool into the gap between the reload and the cartridge, and pry the reload until it is separated from the stapler. When the emergency gear is enabled, the stapler will be in a disabled state and enabled to be used for any subsequent firing. If the jaws are not open after pressing the reverse button, please first ensure that the battery pack is firmly installed in place. If the jaws are still not open while the stapler is in the power on state, the emergency gear for withdrawing should be activated. Push the bottom of the emergency gear cover on the top of the stapler toward the jaws until the bottom can no longer move forward. Release the bottom at this time and then open the emergency gear cover. After opening the emergency gear cover, lift the folding handle upward until it is fully straight. There will be a click when it is fully straightened, and move the handle back and forth until the jaws are fully open. If there is no corresponding articulation after a long press of the deflection button, and the stapler is in the power arm state, the emergency gear for deflection should be activated. When the jaws are fully open, push the up and down buttons of emergency gear for deflection towards the handle at the same time. Until the jaws are deflected back to the middle position.